Hello everyone, welcome back to another review. Today we are taking a look at five very special citizen watches. These are from the premium range of citizen watches in our website. They are the Satellite Wave series. Now these are, in my opinion, um, modern day analog smartwatches though um, their design might seem a bit archaic and not in line with the smartwatches like the apple watch or huawei samsung smartwatches that we're used to but these are very very clever technological pieces um, they would go up against i would say the seiko astron range just that some of them are a lot more affordable but with similar features as well and without any compromises whatsoever so the first one we're taking a look at is the cc 755 limited edition i have a pair here um, in green and gold i personally prefer the greener i think it looks a lot like some of the hyt watches but those are very very different watches in very very different price brackets so as i mentioned these are like smart watches um, they come with a slew of functions and features mainly utc world timer um, time setting alarm many many other functions let me just demonstrate here right away so you don't actually adjust the time on this watch as i mentioned it's a satellite wave gps watch so it pretty much sets itself based on the time zone that you are at, and you can of course set the time zone manually as well so right now as you can see we're in utc mode you just pull the crown out to the first position the seconds hand resets to six instead of zero and you cycle through the functions with the crown as you would set the time so say you're setting the time lock it in and there it is now if you want to change your time zone manually um, you can pull the crown out to the time setting position the second position as you normally would and if you can see the second hand there um, let me just get this in focus goodness yeah this watch is really really hard to photograph and videograph if you notice it's on a very very curved sapphire crystal and yeah this thing is like a disco ball on my wrist and um one thing i do like about it a little sidetrack here is the printing on the dial if you can see it really gives that much more depth and it adds to the very futuristic unconventional look of the watch now you notice the world timer city rings on the um i almost said bezel on the crystal of the watch so as a conventional world timer would you will read the cities like that and the seconds hand will cycle through and indicate which city you are at and the watch will set itself accordingly very 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 cool indeed there's an alarm function as well and of course a power reserve indicator because this is of course a solar powered watch um, it can last about six to ten months on a single full charge very 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 unique watch now let's take a look at the gold one and i'll show you another some external features about the watch i really do like starting mainly with the case you notice that it almost looks like a two-piece construction where the watch is sitting on the lux actually very very unique very skeletal design almost reminds me of a day Bethune watch to be honest and i do like that they skeletonize the pushers as well and these watches they're all in citizens proprietary super black titanium and are of course limited edition this watch may be very chunky but it's very very lightweight thanks to that titanium and very hard as well i do love the finishing on the watch this one's number 350 out of 1500 the green one i believe that one's number 679 out of 1500 now besides these two um, we have three more on metal bands these are very very lovely watches um my favorite out of those two is the one in green but out of this trio this one's my favorite actually it has a very very gorgeous gorgeous case and bracelet design if you notice it's an integrated bracelet i do love the angles on the case if you can see very unique very reminiscent of those 1970s sport watches like the older Piguet royal oak or the Patek Philippe Nautilus and the Vacheron Constant 10 Overseas or 222. Very, very unique, lovely integrated bracelet. Um, let me just put this on the wrist. And in case you guys were wondering, the previous 7005 models, those two, they are about 49 millimeters in diameter, so they were quite large on the wrist. This one's a bit more 
conventional. This one comes in about 45 millimeters in diameter. You can see it sits very, very nicely on the wrist and it shares similar functions and features to the 7005 as well. So this is the time zone setting. And of course you use the crown in the first position to cycle through the uh, mode setting. So that's a chronograph right there. And you can see the second time zone indicator will become a chronograph sub down once you set it. Um, very, very, very unique watch, this one. Just activate the chronograph for you guys. It's a very, very, very beautiful watch, this. Um, the other one I have is this pilot's watch. This one is the CC7015. Um, this one's running on the caliber F990. The exact same caliber as the previous CC9009. And of course, these watches, they're all in titanium as well. So this might look like a very big, chunky watch, but it's very, very lightweight. Very, very, very premium feeling as well. Um, has a internal rotating bezel. It's, as I mentioned, a pilot's watch. I would say this would be like a very a smartwatch version of a Breitling Navi timer. Similar movement as well, so you get these similar complications and features as well. Very, very beautiful watch, and I do like that they have the ground-to-air surface signal code in case, well, in case you find yourself in a nasty situation like that. And the last one that we'll look at is a very, very sporty piece as well. This one, there are hints of motorsport for this um, in terms of the bezel design and the splashes of yellow. This one's also running on the caliber E600, so similar caliber as the previous models. You can cycle the modes and functions using the first position of the crown. And this is of course satellite radio control S is all of them as well. Very, very striking piece, very, very beautiful. This is what it looks like on the wrist. I would say this would be like say an edifice but on steroids, on very, very, very hardcore steroids. Absolutely striking watch to look at in titanium as well. These, wa these watches are all available on our website. Do feel free to browse for them whenever you want to. And of course, I'll see you guys again. Have a nice day, everyone.